Okay, hello everybody. I'm still trying to get fixed in my chair, y'all. Y'all know me. Can't get fixed before I turn the camera on. I have to wait and get the camera on first, then start getting fixed. <laughs> Alright, welcome back to Shay's Hobby Doc Bay. This is Friday. It is March the 15th, 2019. And it's 8.38 a.m. in the morning time. Can y'all believe that? <laughs> Of course, I went to bed early last night, so I was able to get up early today. I've done ate my breakfast, took my medicine, all that. Grace Girl won't be here till somewhere between 9 30 and 10. Um, so I thought now is the best time. Elizabeth got up and left and went to work. Hubby's gone to work. I'm here by myself. Now is the best time to do what videos I need to make. All right, so this video is another hobby horse club meeting um so welcome to our hobby horse club meeting i'm bringing this meeting to order <laughs> all right um roll call we are going to call the roll <laughs> our members are Audie, who is Kathy, Miss, Miss, I started saying Mississippi again, but I think it's Miss, not Mississippi, Miss Crafty Girl 42, here on YouTube. Yvonne Grubb, who is Yvonne Grubb's Crafting World, I think. I hope I'm not getting that messed up. And there I went and said Yvonne again, because it looks, with the Y in the front, it looks so much like it's supposed to be Yvonne. If it's going to be Yvonne, it needs an E in the front, not a Y. <laughs> That's my opinion. <laughs> but Yvonne, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. So, oh, I'm sorry. I forgot. As I call your names off, please let me know you're here when you come and watch the video in the comments below. All right. Next is Sandra Hazen. And next is Aletta Van Brock. No, <laughs> I have another friend that's got Van in her last name. It's Van Brocklin. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Aletta. <laughs> Aletta Van Mears. I think I say that right. I hope I say your name right and not mess it up. So, Shay, I'm here. <laughs> and Veronica. That is, I'm not calling their names off. Sandra's YouTube is Sandra Hazen. Aletta's is Aletta Van Mears. Mine is Hobby Dog Bay. Veronica is Rose of City. Did I say that right? I hope so. <laughs> if I didn't, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so that's everybody. When you come into the video to watch the meeting, let us know in the comments below that you was here. <clears throat> okay. How has everybody been doing? I hope everybody has been well and not sick. No pain whatsoever. I sure ain't been without pain. For the last several days, probably weeks now, it seems like I have been in pain with my sciatica nerve. And I have been in so much pain that I can't hardly move. I cry. It makes me feel bad and I don't feel like doing anything. So yeah, I still have Gracie every day. But I just sit and let her play and watch cartoons. I don't really do anything much. Because I don't feel like it, you know. And then I definitely go to nap with her when, she, when it's nap time. So I can lay down and rest some more. But, uh, so yeah, I've been in a lot of pain. I actually went to the doctor yesterday. It was my checkup, uh, to recheck my, um, uh, the di I call it the diabetic numbers. I don't know all those big medical words they use. But anyway, uh, all of that was good. Um, except for my thyroid. They said my thyroid, which she just called that in today said my thyroid number was up and she has to up my medicine. I don't know what this means. 
you know, things like this scare me. I hope I ain't got cancer. Me, 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 me. Anyway, so, uh, my light's dimming on my camera again. So, um, but yeah, they gave me a shot yesterday. And I'm a little bit disappointed in my doctor. She's going to start getting untrustworthy with me. She led me to believe that she gave me a steroid shot. She didn't give me no steroid shot. Because that's what I thought it was. I mean, she didn't say, no, it's too early for the steroid shot. I can't give you that too often. I'm just going to give you a pain shot. Now, if she had explained that to me, I, that would, I'd have been okay with that, you know? I, that's what I want her to do. Uh, but not just, I was telling her how bad pain I was in. And they were seeing how I couldn't hardly walk and get around. And... You know, I, t was, I had asked her, I said, I was wondering if you'd be able to give me that shot again. And so, I was talking about the steroid shot, and she said, well, when was the last time we gave it to you? She did ask me, and she did look on the computer at my records, but she didn't once tell me that it was too early, that she couldn't give it to me, that she could just give me a pain shot. She just would say, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And so, then she had her nurse come in, and give me a shot, but it wasn't the steroid I thought it was. But this did not take my pain away. That was Wednesday. Did I say yesterday? It was Wednesday when I went to the doctor. I'm sorry. Anyway, so that was Wednesday, and I still have my pain. It it ain't went all completely away like it did the first time I got the shot, which was the steroid shot, and that's what I was thinking I was getting this time because they didn't explain. But uh, the doctor, my doctor, well the nurse lady called this morning to tell me about my thyroid result number and I asked them about the pain, telling them the pain the shot didn't take the pain away and she explained to me it wasn't a steroid shot, it was just a pain shot, that it was too early to give me the steroid shot mm -hmm. why couldn't my doctor have told me that you know anyway, so that's how I'm feeling and been feeling and that is also why y'all may have noticed that for the past, I don't know how many days now, I've not had a video up because I have not had any in stock. Now, Mondays, okay, do it this way, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, I have certain videos I do on those days. Well, actually, I skipped a Sunday and didn't. I've got them in stock, but I was in so much pain, I wasn't able to get on my laptop and I didn't feel like uploading a video so because when I lately my internet's been slow and when I upload a video I can't watch any videos while I'm uploading the video and it would take so long like an hour and something or more and so uh, that keeps me from watching my videos and y'all know how I'm backed up on my videos and my email and I'm keeping on trying to to watch them and get them down so I wanted to watch videos so I picked that over loading a video because <laughs> I felt so bad and wanted to just watch videos but anyway so um <clears throat> I haven't had any videos up because the other days I don't have anything in stock and I didn't feel like making any videos so that's why no videos because I've just felt bad and been in pain. So that's how I've been going. So y'all tell us about y'all. I hope everybody else is painless, pain-free, and good. Because <laughs> it's not fun being in pain. Alright, so the weather. Tell us about y'all's weather. Right now it is rainy outside. If it's raining right now, it's like very sprinkly, misty. It's not like a down pouring where you can hear it and I got my blinds open I'm seeing outside but it's a very cloudy day um and yesterday it was the wind was blowing it ain't blowing right now but anyway the weather is not good I don't like rainy weather I can't drive I don't want to get out and drive in the rainy weather in other words so I don't but not that I feel like going anywhere today anyway and I got my Gracie girl but um, so, there's that, but tell us about your weather. I don't know what the temperature is or anything. Anyway, so, how did everybody's day go today, or whenever you watch this video? Did it go the way you had it planned, your schedule, your, um, 
what did you call it, the routine you have for yourself? Did everything go smoothly? Me? No. Not with me in pain. I can't do what I want to do. So, <laughs> I wish that would stop dimming. So, anyway, tell us about, you know, your day and how it went. Okay. <clears throat> Club business. I had asked y'all about, um... Everybody taking turns with the, I feel like my camera's not fixed right. My chin's cut up. Almost. There we go. I think that's better. Um, about, you know, us taking turns doing the um, craft of the month every month. Because it was getting hard for me to come up with something all the time. But anyway, uh, hey girl, here comes the y'all. <gasps> <sighs> Sorry. So, um, we had, I had several people say different things. So I didn't really know what to do. So I asked y'all to vote. So I've had two votes. And both of those votes was on the same thing. So that's what we're going to go with. I like that idea too. So, the deal is... Y'all are all going to give me ideals, and y'all can give me these ideals anytime you want to. In any club video in the comments, or if it's live in the sidebar when you're typing, texting, typing to me, whatever. Anytime. If you think of something, write it down so you don't forget. Club ideals for Craft of the Month. And when y'all give them to me, I will write them down and put them in the bowl. And every month we'll draw one. So that's how we'll do it. Okay. So. Love you <sighs> So sorry. Other business? Alright, hang on just a minute. It just flew right out of my mind. Uh, I hate when that happens. Give me a minute. <laughs> oh, okay. I know what it is. Oh, Lord. Other business. I know that I said that I wanted us to do live videos for the club. A video. And I do because they're fun. And so then I was thinking maybe we could do alternate, you know, back and forth, taking turns, a regular video like this, or the live video. That's not going to be able to happen every time. <laughs> As y'all can see, this is supposed to be on Wednesday. Wednesday's the day I have set for the club meeting video to be put up. But this is Friday, as y'all can see. So, um, because I've been in pain so bad and haven't felt good and haven't felt like making a video when I would be by myself without Gracie where I could. So see, that's another factor. If I have Gracie, I can't make a video. So, uh, because of that reason, we're not going to say that we're going to alternate it and take turns. I'm going to do mostly probably regular videos. Only when I'm feeling real good and feel like it, I'll try to get on and do a live. But I have all of the members' uh, phone numbers I can text you and let you know when I am getting or when I'm going to do a live video for the club meeting. Okay? Alrighty. I hope everybody is okay with that. Okay. So, next up. Show and tell. All right. We have got some good show and tell for this month. It's already ready. Month of March. Aletta Van Meers was our show and tell person. I remember up to do show and tell. So, she don't make videos. Excuse me. So, I'm sorry, y'all. But she sent me pictures, and she's wrote a little something out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to read what she's talking about first in one video, and then I'll show y'all that video, and then I'll read the next thing and show you the next, not video, pictures. I'm sorry, y'all. Overlook me. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to get the camera and turn it around. So, here we go. I'm going to read her letter. It says, Hi, Shay. Here is my show and tell for this month. And enjoy. So, she says, 
first one is my diamond painting with flamingos. Alright, so I have to scroll back and forth from letter to pictures. So, and then I'm going to have to find, let me see, this is the first picture. I'm not sure. I think this one kind of messed up on her. And so this is what it's showing. It's not showing at all. Y'all let me find the flamingo. That's it. Okay. So there it is. She is working on a diamond painting flamingo. And I love pink flamingos. So it looks like it's going to be pretty. This right here looks like the starting of another flamingo. So... Maybe that's what the whole picture looks like right there. I'm not sure. So that's her diamond painting. All right, now let me go back out and go back to the letter. So then she says, Second is a box I made long ago with colored popsicle sticks. Okay, so here is that picture. So she's showing the sticks, and then she's showing a box she made. And I love that. That's cool. That is neat. You could put some little things in that. She probably even uses it to put, like, little craft supplies or something in. I like that idea. That's cool. I might even want to make me one. All right, let's go see the next one. Oh, this one here, she's showing her bag of... The craft sticks, popsicle sticks. All different colors. <gasps> okay. I wish I'd stop yelling. Ah! Alright. Third is a whole bag full. Okay, that was that one. See what I can do with it. Yeah, she wants to see what else she can make with those popsicle sticks. Alright, let's see. Her fourth picture is a few of her hundreds, she says of cross-stitched hangings on the wall. So let's go look at those. All right. Come on, get up there. Look at there. So she's got a cross and there's a little girl. This might be, is this one of the little, um, what do they call them? Is it promise girls, they call it? And then that looks like flowers. And that looks like a pineapple and some more flowers, maybe with a butterfly. And then there's a little heart with flowers on it. So that's her cross stitching stuff that she makes on her wall. Cool. Let me see if there was any more. Uh, she mentions this one in another one, so hang on tight. All right, her fifth picture is of a hexagon quilt. I am also working on. All right, let's go see. It may be, yeah, right here. So she's got two pictures. One messed up. It's only showing half of it, but you can still see pretty good. And it's, I love that. I love the colors and I love the, the hexagon. It makes it look like a flower. So this one here, let's see. Well, there's another little part of it. Okay, so the other one showed a little more. Yeah. So anyway, we can see enough of it that it we can tell what it is, and it's cute. And I can't wait to, you know, it'd be good to see the whole thing there. Okay, so let's see what's next. Uh, I made three more pictures, but I'll send them in another email, she says, because the file was too long, too big. Okay, so... We're going to go to the other letter. These are the last three pictures. The first is a cross-stitched Christmas tree she glued on felt. The next one is the map of the USA, which she cross-stitched last, last year. The last one is the one I'm working on right now, also American-themed with Uncle Sam. And it reads, America, land that I love. The okay, and then she says, I love the colors in it, and then she says, I hope y'all enjoy my pictures. So let's go up and see those pictures. That's this one right here. So there's the cross stitched map that is cool, y'all. I love come on, Mike. We've been 
I love the USA map. And then look at that. That's got all kind of look at look at there. There's a tractor.